I'm 23 and I've been a professional tag athlete for a couple of years. That was so clutch going up and over the ridge because it looked to me like Bobby had it. After uh, applying to fire departments and police departments both and failing to get into those so many times, I took it as a sign that isn't where God wanted me to be. Um, because every time I failed, it was in a completely different area that didn't make any sense. So I took that as a sign that I need to do something more, and I looked into military. I didn't know about gear, how you would get that until I showed up, and everybody just had that gear, and I'd prefer to grab the gear that I know that everybody's using that works. The late entry program is meeting once or twice a month. They, they didn't have much for us. They just see where your push-ups are at. You do max push-ups in two minutes. You do max plank, but they cap the planks off. So I just like, well, we'll just go for two minutes and cut it there. And then it's a mile and a half run. And that was it. The warrior challenge meetings is what they call them. Um, it's more intense. I heard deep in, about Deep in Fitness through the uh, CrossFit gym I went to. And I had just enlisted in the Navy, and I was like, well, this is perfect timing. The first class was, we had the screener. It was good. At that point, I've already tested myself a little in the water. Like, oh, let's see, I'll tread for five minutes, because my dad was in the Navy, and he did that, you know? And then I got to Deep in Fitness, and I, your screener's like, oh, you gotta tread for 10 minutes out, out the rip. And I was like, okay, well, we'll see how it goes. And, um, I pretty much did everything except for the underwater crossover the first time around. And that underwater crossover really showed my weaknesses and what, did I, what I really need to work on. So the screener like, was tremendously helpful with realizing what I was lacking in the water. I did that 25 meter underwater crossover because it was, it, was, it was actually really difficult for me. The, the physical hits first. Your, your body's trying to suck in air and you're underwater, then your brain starts to give up on you. It makes you quit sometimes. And then I came in and had a, just good help around me in a good environment and hit the 50. Before those, those 25 meters, those 50s, would have seemed impossible because my breath work and my breath holds were, were definitely not the best until uh, until I found Deep in Fitness, they, they worked on that. There's no amount of reading or watching that's gonna prepare you for actually doing, and you can do some of these things on your own. You don't get as much as instruction. Um, it's hard to watch yourself and know what you're doing wrong, so just go and actually do the thing. Because the longer you sit and wait and go, oh, I'm not ready, the less likely you are to actually just show up. Appreciate it, man. Thank you. Thank you.